everybody welcome back to the channel I'm leaving again I'm leaving again y'all on an international situation it's, we're to the final hour right now while you're watching this I'm already there oh my god gosh it scared me I thought this was a uh, thought this was a snake for a second now it is way too early for chickens to be in bed where are you chickadees there you are I have to fill up their feed before I leave. You'd be amazed how much feed uh, chickens go through, and I only have two now, so <laughs> it's a little less. We're gonna fill up the royal rooster here, and we're literally leaving within like 30 minutes, so. Girls, this is also kind of my goodbye. Uh, hopefully while I'm gone, you start your egg laying process, but if you don't, uh, we're gonna work on that when we get back. We're gonna have some fresh eggs. It's time, full grown now. My chickens, they get scratch and peck. Scratch and peck feeds. It's a nice organic feed. I get it off Amazon. Feed is good. That should last them for uh, at least a week. That thing right there will hold water for two weeks and it's cool and fresh. And they just love it. Normally this stuff is documented over at the Lake Life Family Channel. Link down below. By the way, uh, we are almost to 80,000 subscribers over there, so go subscribe, and we're trying to get to 100K and get our comments turned back on over there. That would be just greatly appreciated. Okay, let's get into the other stuff I'm taking here. I have my bow secured. I have enough clothes for about a week and a half, and then I have my camera bag. The preparation level on this one is nothing like... New Zealand. I had to prepare so much because I was literally just taking everything on my back and uh, a lot of it was survival based. Uh, you know, just taking the proper gear to succeed in the elements. And there were some elements, if you do remember. But on this one, I don't want to say it's like a last minute thing. Uh, it's a bucket list thing, but I didn't I didn't suspect I'd be going on a hunt like this for uh, for many years. I pretty much didn't want to go when I got asked. I uh, just wasn't ready. Like New Zealand was was really my trip for the year. So I'll get into uh, why I am going now and uh, where we're going here in just a second when we meet up with you know him, Lunkers TV. We are witnessing steps. Steps, like the walking. Oh, honey. More like slinks. It, she's a scooter. She likes to scoot. She goes for the three-prong approach. She's standing up now and she's starting to walk, you guys. <laughs> so at least I've been able to uh, to witness that before before I go. Are we going to see it right now? Not... Is, this, is this happening? Oh, she reaches out. She reaches out. Come on. There she goes. <laughs> Up there. Okay, I mean, just hold on, keep practicing, and when I get back, we're gonna walk together. You ever get that feeling like you're unprepared? You just started packing today, didn't you? I did. How many of you have ever gone internationally on a flight and just packed the day of? I can yeah. tell you, no woman is raising their hand right now. Yeah. I feel like I'm forgetting something. You are, you're forgetting Emmy and I. Oh my gosh! What is you. that? You don't want to go where I'm going. That's true, I don't. You really don't. <laughs> I really don't. I don't think any of you want to go where I'm going. I don't even want to go where I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> That's the crazy part. New Zealand, babe, was like my trip. It was the trip of the year. It was the trip? That was like the one. And then I was like, I'm done. I'm gonna stay here. But. There is an agreement in place, and you know the agreement. Mm -hmm. That's all so reminded. So I can pretty much bank on when I, how you doing neighbor? When I come back, there will be some furniture pieces or some things bought. Mm -hmm. That's just the deal. If I leave the country, OSG has pretty much free reign of uh, home buying situations. Please support this channel any way you can so that I don't go broke on this trip. This is gonna be a whopper doozy right here. Not because of the hunt. I was gonna say, because of you or because of me? Because of her. <laughs> a lot of people have expressed their enthusiasm for the collaborations 
with uh, myself and Rob at Lunkers TV. They enjoy our um, on-screen partnerships together. Even my dad said yesterday, he called, actually called me this morning, and uh, we were talking about the trip, and he was like, you know, I just I just really like watching the little videos you make with, uh, with Rob. You know, just, y'all have good chemistry. It's like, I don't know how to take that, Dad. Thank you. Thank you. Bromance going on? There's not a bromance. Anyway, let's go say hi to Rob. See, see how he's doing. I know he's very excited for this trip. We have arrived. Emmy, don't go to sleep. Mommy needs you to stay I up till it's up. till it's bedtime. And she's out. Okay. Dream beautiful dreams, my dear. I'll see you when I get back. And you too. Yes. Be safe. I will be safe. I'll be worrying about you. The fishing freak spirit will be with me. Also with you. Have good luck. Oh yeah, you have the <laughs> best luck ever. Hey! Oh no, that's not true. We're gonna be careful though. We're shutting the power down in here. This is our it's dark. This is ours right here. Oh it is? I didn't realize that. Oh my goodness. So we just got here to the airport and uh, we're about to get on an international flight. We filled our bellies. We're trying to plan out flight strategies. Rob's got it planned out, so uh, had a little bit of carbohydrates, gonna sleep a little bit, wake up in the morning, have breakfast, and then stay up all day before our next flight. And then it's gonna get real nasty. Dirty. 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 <laughs> you know what's really cool? These guys, so this is Ryan. You guys remember Ryan from past videos? We, we call him Quarter Finger. Uh, Quarter Finger Ryan? Uh, how's that finger doing, actually? I forgot it's that. It's fantastic. Um, Everything but the nerves. The feeling in it is good. So is it going to work on those animals is all we care about. Yeah. What, you, what kind of... What kind of what? I don't know. That went weird. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I meant trigger finger. I'm sorry. Okay. Anyways. Yeah. Rob's going to be in a cube. Are you going to document the cube experience? I to, I've never yeah. sat in one. So. Yeah. An international yeah. inside of a... Inside to. of like a module. I'm going to be in the dog kennel in the back. But it'll be fun. landed in another country and we got one more flight. We're just having a little breakfast here. Got some beans and wieners. Beans and wieners. <laughs> Getting my first taste of uh, English food. Beans, beans and wieners. Not, not very good. <laughs> uh, sausage? No. It's not very good? They use that same spice they use in New Zealand a lot. It's like... Something we don't use in America very much. We're in the land of London, London, right now. Uh, we're we're waiting for our next flights. It's been a doozy. Um, we've been here since I don't even know. I've lost track of time. I know it's about noon back in Dallas. It's six thirty here, and we have an eleven-hour flight coming up. Why am I Why am I doing this? Why? Why do I want to sit on a plane for this long to, to go to this crazy place that we're going to? Well, it all has to do with uh, this man right here with the Just Farmer shirt. You know, I, I I turned you down on this trip a few times. <laughs> yeah, you did. And, and uh, Rob just has a way of convincing. I come uh, in hard. He's like, you're Coming just going to go. You're going to go. You just <laughs> have to go. I, I actually don't even know the place that we're going to. Like, so I, I know the continent. I know the continent. So, you know, know the, first the, time I, the first time I came here, I didn't even know it was a continent. I thought it was just one big thing. Like, <laughs> oh, I'm going to Africa. <laughs> oh. No, but, there's different countries within there. Yeah, there's a lot. <laughs> I didn't know that. There, it's, it's quite huge. And I don't know the name of the town. I don't know. Uh, I don't. Either. I don't know. We're just getting in a truck or a Jeep or a Subaru or a Toyota, most likely. <laughs> and then, <laughs> right? Yeah, Isn't that your, your experience? And then we're, we're heading out. We're hoping that we're, get, we're gonna get there and everything is, is great and grand and wonderful and we have a nice place to stay, but he's telling me he's brought bug nets. I've got a bug yeah. net, I've got a sleeping bag, and I've got seven pounds worth of my own food packed. Seven pounds of cookies. cookies. Protein cookies, which means Two mega nasty farts. And let me tell you, I don't have any of that. 
I just didn't really ask many questions, and I just said yes. You ever done something like that? That's just that's some trust. That's some trust. <laughs> we'll see how that works out here in a little bit. 11-hour flight coming at you right now. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, we have officially made it. We're loading up the car right now. Now we got about an hour and a half drive. Our last bit of a journey. Okay. Good. Well, welcome, welcome, yeah, guys. Good to meet you, Patrick. Yeah. Okay. First thoughts, South Africa, absolutely beautiful. We're around the ocean right now. Guess what they have here? Meat pies. They have meat pies. We're gonna have a little taste of a meat pie. Remember New Zealand? Delicious meat pies? Well, they got them here too. Can we tell them where we are? Not Patrick, sorry. We don't have a big secret. Uh, Africa, again. Third round for you. Third round for you. First two were e first two were interesting. You know what's weird? You're wearing a jacket in Africa. Take five. Take five. They didn't come in a little foil thing like Thank that you. though. Well, I'm just gonna bread that time. I really like it. Good. A lot Good. of meat. A lot of meat. Not quite as flaky they should have, they as should a Zealand pie. Oh, it's firmer, you can just grab it, <laughs> eat it, but it is good. So mm. No, that's a water bug, sorry. So I was gonna ask you. What? Yeah, I was gonna ask you, what was out here in the middle? Did you say water bug? Hey, look at him, he's right there. Look at him. Oh. There he is, majestic. That's a good one. Yeah, look at wow, that dark that water bug. Beautiful mm -hmm. animal. It's a giraffe, dude. What in the world? I need to get my big camera out. Look, look how big there. it is. I look what we're staying, are you? Are you kidding me? There's monstrous sand dunes, the Indian Ocean, and then here is our place we're staying. What in the world? Oh my lands. And New Zealand was a uh, earth shattering view, but this is uh this is quite awesome as well this is gonna be a fun week we just saw giraffes water we saw zebras we saw water bugs monkeys just saw all sorts what? of stuff Apollo. i've never even seen before <laughs> like we are going to have a great time if you don't subscribe what's wrong with you we're about to get crazy out here and you know what there's great white sharks out there too i forgot to mention been a big fan of shark week my whole life lots of big great white sharks oh yeah so this is my room, everybody. <laughs> Look at this. This is nuts. And out there, literally looking at the ocean and the dunes. Here's everything that I packed, y'all. I brought uh, a few pairs of pants, brought the attack pant, a couple of thermals. It is winter here, so we are going to need some warm clothes. I brought uh, my hybrid jacket, it's like a soft shell, water resistant. I currently have my puffy on because it is cold in here. I just turn the heater on. It's going to be between like 45 to 70 degrees and it's going to be windy because we're on the coast. So um, having, having some extra layers, bringing the puffy was a good move. And footwear, I just brought my, uh, my danner, uh, my low cut danner. So I didn't want to bring my really... You know, the ones I brought on my New Zealand trip, because those are super bulky. We're not supposed to run into snakes. Uh, Patrick said they're, it's cold, so we're not going to run into that. We're not going to have, like, crazy bugs. We're already seeing all sorts of animals. We just saw a giraffe. We just saw zebras. We saw a water buck. I mean, it's going to be insane. It's going to be an insane week, y'all. So right now we got to go get our bow sighted in get some guns sighted in, things like that. I am mainly going to be bow hunting this entire time. I can't wait to share all these things with you. The reason that I'm here 
<laughs> is because of Rob. He wanted me to come help him film. I was like, no, I don't, man, I, Africa I already went to New Zealand. He's like, I'll pay for your plane ticket. I said, okay, I'll be there. And so now we're going to get to hunt um, and film each other's hunts and everything. It's going to be really, really fun weeks. I'm going to go enjoy the rest of this evening and go see some animals and things like that get settled in here. And then we start the hunt tomorrow. I'll see you then, guys. Right here.